guys, it's episode uh, 17 of uh, Co-op. I'm Bill Robin, uh, hanging out with uh, things uh, overnight. I've been trying to get more mechanical parts, and hey, it's daytime. Wonderful stuff. Yeah, I had to resort to Shotgun Messiah for more mechanical parts, because uh, work stuffs didn't turn out to have uh, as much as I was hoping for. I'm at 15 now, and just been... Uh, I'm plugging away at these, just trying to and do this. It's like using my wrench for its remainder ability. So wonderful stuff. A little bit thirsty because I took a painkillers overnight, but it's okay. Thankfully, there's some water in the cooler. That's where that sound is. Wondering where you were. I was about to ask oh, if it, yeah. I found uh, puffer coat. I was about to ask if it was me, but I'm like, no wait, you're talking about the zombie. My bad. Oh. Yay, only huh. Uh did you grab the wrench out of my chest out of my uh, workbench? I put it in the left chest. Oh you could have taken it. Yeah, I already have one. Yeah, I think working on uh, just grabbing all these mechanical parts, guys, it's like... But the good news is, uh, especially since I've been scrapping stuff down, uh, should have enough, uh, more than enough iron to upgrade the uh, upgrade my base to full iron and start the concrete process, which is going to be wonderful stuff. Um, run around back here for the air conditioners because I know they have... At least a couple mechanical parts. Unless I already wrenched them all. I was discussing with Fanks because he's got a lot of points and, uh, you know, where or not he should, uh, invest himself into. into the, uh. Steel smithing? Yeah, steel smithing for the mechanical parts because, like, starting to get a little bit scarce to find. If we're gonna make more wrenches over time, it's gonna, gonna be a little, uh, a little tedious to find them. Only one more mechanical part for the uh, new workbench. Still on the search for that 44 Magnum cylinder for you. It's like... Hope, it, hope that 44 Magnum cylinder is not going to be a never-ending saga in this series. Like, will, will you ever find the other 44 Magnum... Well, the, uh, the last 44 Magnum part for the fangs? <laughs> Oh, I know on my world, someone was looking for it for a good few hours. <laughs> it, it sucked for them. I, I felt bad for them just so long, couldn't find anything. Yeah, it's like, uh, for me, I got I got a little infuriated when, uh, when I, in Generation Zero, when I took down a, uh, a Firebird rival and, uh, I didn't know this at the time, but my buddy told me, like, after the fact that they're not worth the, like, the, uh, I took out a scout firebird, uh, that was a rival, and he gave me, he only gave me, like, uh, one star, you know, like, oh, uh, white rarity and green rarity you know, weapons. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. For a rival, that is pretty piss poor loot. For loop. weapons, they that, that much, but they, but for me, at least I found a lot am off of them. Yeah, he's telling me like the scout version of the Firebirds are, they really suck uh, for for weapons. It's like the Spetsnaz Firebirds, uh, oh boy, those things give me a lot of ammunition. So much, uh, like, especially 9mm submachine gun ammo, I'm like, I'm like, I have so much of it to the point where I started scrapping it just so I can have extra uh, lead and gunpowder, lead and explosive. Because I'm like, then I can make more seven. Then I can make more seven six two ammunition. Oh, let's just uh, cap off the iron upgrades, guys. It should be you know, wonderful here. Because thanks to the scrapping of the iron and everything, and we're coming up on the last little bit. Come on. One has one more row, hopefully. There we go, guys. 
the bases have finally got the max iron upgrades. Now for Except the, for the roof. <laughs> well, not, uh, I'm not really on the roof that much, so I'm not really worried about it. I'm, I'm going to turn it into like a second floor, so... Yeah, you got to make the base tall. Yeah, I got to make it nice and tall, and... Well, since I mentioned the idea of making a second floor, I'm actually going to chop this out real quick. Chop out a corner block uh, in the roof and save it for the... Uh, for the... And I'm going to throw in some ladders before I forget anything. Yeah. And... Yeah, we're moving on up in the world, guys. Literally. What is the... What, what is your shotgun type? Is it door shotgun or what? It's a long yeah. shotgun. Uh, I think it's like the short shotgun has a has a worse spread. Like a. What do you mean by worse? Larger. Yeah. So it's best for clearing large crowds. Yeah, pretty much. It's one of those that's like. But I think it also has shorter range. Okay. What? Uh, uh, fangs! What? You didn't tell me that you took my workbench. I did. I said put your thing, your wrench, into your chest. You didn't mention anything about the workbench. I said I just took the... I said that when I first put, told you I put the wrench in the chest. When I first said that. I'm when, like... When you went to go... Drop. Oh, I didn't hear that. I'm sure somebody will probably point that out in the comments, but... Oh, well. It'd be what it'd be. I'm like, I'm like, where the hell did the workbench go? It went poof, gone, nowhere. Everywhere. <laughs> To teleport away. I'm go put some grass down. Oh. Okay, um, new workbench should be coming on up. There we go. Just gotta wait in two minutes, 20 seconds for that. Okay. Um, since I, since I have, uh, two cement mixers over here. Grab that concrete mix, and actually eat something before I forget. I don't want myself starving. That's never a fun feeling. Yeah, starving no. to death. Um. Well, there's my new wrench, and. I was thinking to myself, I'm like, I should probably make myself a new, uh... I should make myself another, uh... Make myself a claw hammer, because... The wrench is nice for... Uh, wrenching stuff down, but, uh... I'm like, probably be a good idea to, uh... Have a claw hammer for faster upgrades. Yeah, probably. One, one thing I tested, like, uh... Because I was curious I might get richer die series, because... I'm one piece off of the nail gun, but uh, I was like, "Can you actually upgrade stuff with a with a partially assembled nail gun?" And no, you cannot. Mm -hmm. Oh, and ironically enough, guys, I look at my chest for some cloth for another splint. I, but it, it turns out that in this series, I have the the one part needed for uh, needed for that. For that dumb, uh, for for that damn nail gun. That's the frame, the yellow part. I'm like, I'm like, I think I had that in, in the series, like uh, in the other series. It's like, yep. Oh. Especially like if you're doing multiple series like me on YouTube, it's like. Do you have any bandages with that that aren't medical? Oh no, never mind. I found mine. Where are those? I was gonna say I have like 208 cloth fragments. I can make you a whole bunch. Are you making med kits? Yeah, or making a med kit. 
Well, my workbench is finally done, so... And... I just need to make myself a claw hammer, but... While I wait for... Oh, wait that... I'll just use my new wrench to start upgrading... The concrete. going. Okay, after after like grabbing more out of the concrete mixers now, I'm I've officially started on the fourth level of my base uh, with concrete. Four. Yeah, like four blocks up. Oh, that's the second floor. Fourth level is also the fourth floor, which is why I was so. No, it's like I'm. No, it's like. I'm only working on the no. I'm only working on like just my basic shelter at the moment. And it's like I'm about I'm already four blocks up. Yeah, once I get yeah, guys, once I get this done, which at this rate it's going pretty well, but uh, I should be able to just uh, start absolutely blitzing through uh, blitzing through the levels here. Oh. Idiot me, even though I was walking right into my base. Do you have more forge steel in your forge? Are you going to try and... What you need? Oh, I just want to make a steel pickaxe. Uh, give me a... Yeah, you can take some. I need to get more clay. I need to start painting me in clay so I can actually start making more. It's not going to be an efficient cycle. Why can't I run or jump? I mean, here in like four and four levels. I, of I should, there we go. Here in four levels of uh, construction tools, I'll actually uh, start being able to make uh, more steel. So, okay, guys, I'm gonna uh, make a steel pickaxe and grab some more resources here, and then uh, and I'll tune in with you shortly. All right, everybody. I'm back from moving in. Uh, well, getting more resources. Got more cement on the craft. Uh, I know resource the uh, inventory is looking a little bit messy, but gonna do a little bit of a bit rating here for the end of the day here. Try to get you know, just see what's around town. I'm starting to kind of forget like where I have and haven't been in this town, like for raiding houses. Because we looted so much, and over so much time. Yeah. Oh, let's just check out this house here. Oh, this door is unlocked. Uh, oh, I thought for a second this was the, uh, the house that has a flood basement in it. Um... These corpses, nothing on them in terms of magnum parts. Gun safe. Bad. Yeah, I was just telling things like, you know, it'd be nice, like, cause, like, trying to make some men, it's like, you know, basically it's a. It's, as, if you're not making you know, stones into sand, it's like, you know, it's basically a two to one of stone to, like, two stones per cement mix, which is, uh, you know, it's all that, uh, some decent stuff in the gun safe there. It's, uh, making, uh, basically like a two to one ratio of that stuff. It's like, I wish you could just split a stack and then, uh, you could just say, like, you know, how much you want to split into. It's one of those just little tedious features. I wish it would be the, you know, I hope the Fun Pump Stew and the PC version, well, the new version of console coming out. It's like, it would just be such a nice little quality of life uh, thing if you're trying to split that up. Nothing really upstairs in this house. Um, read the kitchen at least, see if there's anything in here. More, more, more. Uh, were you going for a sawed-off shotgun or a full shotgun? Uh, I have a sawed-off shotgun. Why? Now does they have parts? Yeah, I got you a, well, they're low level, but a sawed-off stock and a barrel. Oh, then I don't need it. I'm good on a barrel for now. What level's your barrel? Like 180, fine. Ah. I'll let you know if I do find a high-level barrel. 
popping into this house. Oh, hey, it's Muscle Dude, aka Psycho Steve. Come here, buddy. Good to see you. Unfortunately, he died in his own home. Wow. Yeah, he was already in the house. Yeah, he, uh, he was already in the house, so I'm like, eh, sucks to be you. You're, you're dying in your own home. Huh, little wooden chest in the first world house, like, all, you know, it looks like our chest, but it's one of the low capacity ones. And nothing really in the kitchen, there's, well, nothing in the stove really. Just more junk. Drink that water real quick. Eh, not doing too bad water. Refrigerator. Blueberry pie. I'll eat that straight away. Is blueberry pie that not helpful? It gives you... No, I'm just like, I'm already hungry. I'm like... It's like, I'm like... If I hit, if I find something that gives me wellness, I usually just eat it straight away. It's like uh, after a certain point, I just kind of stop having canned food. I just grab it down for iron. Uh. Nothing really in the upstairs. No blueberry pie gives you plus one wellness. Nice. And we'll just check out this other little bit of. Uh, House here. And okay, let's raid the rooms here because there's usually some good stuff. Hopefully, at least something. Oh, hey, a rocket launcher schematic. Nice. I didn't have that red. And I don't think I have it either. It was in a. It was in a. A nightstand of all things. Well, that's one thing to keep on nightstand. How to craft an RVD? <laughs> Where <are you> dumbasses? <laughs> They'll never find my RPG schematic. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you get, if you know how to craft that. Say goodbye to the neighborhood. <laughs> Now I got the now I got the image of uh, Elmo staring at an, at an atomic bomb going off. <laughs> I mean, it's a possibility. <laughs> one that I might not like. Oh, did you have a pistol schematic? Uh, I don't think I do. Uh, yeah, I, 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 accident, I accidentally read a second one out of habit. Eh, I don't really, I'm not interested in this. Now, if it's the Magnum, I would've gotten mad. I'm the one that liked the Magnum. I mean, I love the Magnum too, but you, you already laid claim to it, so. Speaking of the Magnum, I got good news for you. I found not one- You got one... the grip? Or the cylinder? I found two cylinders. Nice, we can find those. I One's just need the... the buck. I mean, if you bring the parts over to me, I can assemble it for you. Wait, you already ain't what? Yeah, I can, I can already assemble it, I believe. Yep, I can. Oh, hey, a wandering horde. <laughs> I don't know if I can assemble it or not. Come here, zombies. Yes, yeah, Nope, it's not. Let's say, oh no. No, it's like I I come out of the I come out of the house and I find a uh, I find a wandering horde. Fun. I like hello XP. Come here. There's just gonna be like corpses just scattered all over the town, but then again they despawn. Are you not gonna pick up all those frames you, you put down? I completely forgot about them, to be honest. Oh no. 
Taste my shotgun, zombies. Now you get the 9mm. How was this one zombie so buff? The shirtless one? No, the survivor. The infected survivor. They are incredibly dead. <laughs> uh, I don't ask questions. Uh, but... Wandering Horde taken care of, and I've got 35 points to spend now, but saving 30 of those for steel. Yeah, only only a few levels off of that now, but... Um... Actually, depending on gunsmithing... I feel like I could at least invest in a 9mm crafting if I felt like it. It's only 5 points. The next level of, uh... The next level of ammunition unlocks is, uh... Shotgun shell crafting at level 25, and I'm at level 18. Mm. Well, I got the parts for you. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, just bring it over to my base and I'll... I'll get them assembled for you. As well as combine the two cylinders. Yep, I'll be sure to put the two c cylinders together right now. And there we go, that's together. Let me just put some stuff away in the in the old uh, chest here. But there we go. Pile. There, there we go. And wait a minute. I think I might just checking to see if I have any extra magnum frames for you. Ah, uh, yes, I have a. I have a magnum frame that is, uh, that is the exact same level as the one you gave me. 14? Well, yep. Wow. Well, at least it's almost uh, fully repaired. And... 44 magnum should be... I was like, I was like, I, said, I scrapped it. Then I'll make a... Let me make a... Uh, weapon repair kit. Oh, I actually have one on me. Well, in my chest. Three of them. Just get it repaired for you. Do you have any magnum ammunition? Yeah, I do. Okay, here you go. Level 101 for you. Enjoy. I'll use it sparingly until I have the schematic. Yeah, magnum... Uh, magnum is, uh, like, uh, level 40 in gunsmithing. What do you mean? 44 Magnum ammunition. Oh, I don't, I don't need ammo. Oh, how much ammunition do you got for it? Like 1 to 200. Okay, guys, that's about it for today's episode, so it's nighttime now. We're going to do some more uh, stuff overnight, and uh, I hope you all enjoyed. Have a great day.